Hello, hello, and welcome to the Borealis Experience. I'm your host, Aurora, and I'm very happy to be spending some time with you today. Ah, oh, the reason I'm chuckling is that last week's episode was not published. So what I'm saying right now is that I'm happy to be spending some time with you, but I don't even know if this episode is going to be published. Oh, it sucks so much. Mm. Of course, I reached out and asked for support from the podcast platform, but yeah, they don't know what is going on. So I really hope that today's episode is going to go out there because I feel like I'm letting people down and that's horrible. Today I want to talk about how life is tough and rough at times and there's nothing you can do about it. You know, I'm all for positivity, I'm all for self-motivation, I'm all for reaching out to find support But sometimes you do all that, you meditate, you eat well, you exercise, or you don't. You do whatever is good for you on your terms, and life is still tough and rough. And I think it's just part of life. There's nothing you can do about it. There's no recipe on how to get out of it. There's no recipe on how to speed up the process. There's no tools that you can instantly apply. It is just, yeah, very difficult. And I feel a lot of people are going through this right now. A lot of people feel weird, um, feel that extreme uncertainty, um, feel the big shift that humanity is going through right now. And I think I want to remind us that it is okay to struggle at times. Um, things will change and get resolved. Um, things will be uncomfortable, but comfort is coming up soon again. Sometimes we just got to be patient. And that's the most difficult thing ever, at least for me. Um, but giving up is not an option. It's just not. Um, you can, you know, get loud, get frustrated. You can get angry and mad or you can get super sad and depressed and avoid people and reject any interaction, but it's not going to help you. You're just going to waste energy. It's going to feel good in the moment because you can release what you have inside of you. But sometimes we're just going to wait and see and maybe ask ourselves, okay, what is it I'm supposed to learn here? Why? Why is this happening? What is it that I can learn? And to be very, very gentle with yourself. And that if you don't come up with an answer, that's okay too. All this to say, struggle is a big part of human experience. And some people tend to give up too soon or make weird conclusions about themselves, their environment, the world as a whole, humanity, and that's not good. It's not going to serve you on the long run. I'm actually talking to myself right now to, <laughs> to get through this difficult phase, and I hope I can bring you value as well, and empowerment and motivation and connection. 
It is so utterly important to stay connected to yourself and to feel your pain and to be there. Yeah, I think that was my quick message that I wanted to get out there. And as I said at the beginning, I don't even know if this time around the episode will be published. Um, it makes me realize how passionate I am about my podcast and connecting with you. And that's truly beautiful. <laughs> Sometimes you appreciate things way more when they are gone or when it gets difficult and then you overcame the difficulties. And um, yeah, if I didn't care, I wouldn't be this mad and frustrated. So that's a good sign, I guess. guess. <laughs> All right. Please take really good care of yourself. Please know that I will be okay. I will fight with everything I have to get my podcast, my baby here going again um, because it is so dear to my heart to be able to, yeah, empower people from around the globe and um, I will be out there very soon again. Your warrior, your fighter, Aurora. <laughs> And in the meantime, if you feel like connecting with me over Facebook, uh, of course, you're not going to hear this if the episode is not being published. But I truly hope that, yeah, you joined the groups, you joined um, my Facebook account before this all happened so that I can keep in contact with you over Facebook at least. All right. Till next time when everything runs normal again. Bye-bye. And thank you for being here. I deeply appreciate you. <laughs> <laughs>